Hi everyone, I am Arun Julka and today's topic is indefinite integral. In part 1, we already discussed some basic formula of integration. In part 2, we will talk about substitution method. Whenever derivative of denominator present in numerator, answer is log denominator. Example 1. Integrate 2x plus 3 whole divided by x square plus 3x plus 7 with respect to x. Now in this question derivative of denominator present in numerator. So put denominator x square plus 3x plus 7 equals to t. Differentiate respect to x both side 2x plus 3 equals to dt by dx. So 2x plus 3 whole multiplied by dx equals to dt. Replace the value in the question and we get dt upon t. Integration of 1 by t respect to t is log mod t plus c and replace t by x square plus 3x plus 7. Example 2. Integrate e raised to the power x plus 1 whole divided by e raised to the power x plus x respect to x. Now derivative not present in the numerator so put denominator equals to t and we will get derivative respect to x e raised to the power x is e raised to the x plus 1 equals to dt by dx. So e raised to the power x plus 1 dx equals to dt. In question we get dt upon d and the one integration of 1 by t is log mod t plus c. Replace t by e to the power x plus x and the answer is log e raised to the power x plus x plus c. Whenever in a question we have dx upon ax plus b, integration is log in mod ax plus b whole divided by a plus c. Whenever we have integration of ax plus b whole raised to power n, answer is ax plus b whole raised to power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 and multiplied by a plus c. Now we will solve some question on that. Example, integrate 1 upon 2 plus 3x plus 1 upon 3 minus 4x plus 5x plus 6 whole raised to the power 2 plus 1 upon 7 minus 8x whole raised to the power 3 and integration respect to x. The answer to the first part is log 2 plus 3x in mod whole divided by 3. Next is log in mod 3 minus 4x whole divided by minus 4. Next is 5x plus 6 whole raised to the power 3 divided by 3 and multiply by 5. And next is 7 minus 8x whole is power minus 2 upon minus 2 and multiply by minus 8 plus c. And then we simplify this, we'll get 1 by 3 log in mod 2 plus 3x minus 1 by 4 log in mod 3 minus 4x plus 1 by 15 5x plus 6 whole is power 3 plus 1 by 16 multiplied by 1 upon 7 minus 8x whole square plus c. Next example. 3 divided by 5 plus 2x respect to x. Integrate next is 3x whole divided by x square plus 7 respect to x. Now the derivative denominator is 2. So take 3 common, divide by 2 and multiply by 2. In the next part, derivative of the denominator is 2x. So divide by 2 and multiply by 2 and take 3 common. So we have 2x upon x square plus 7 dx. Whenever derivative denominator present in the numerator, answer is log denominator. So answer is 3 by 2 log 5 plus 2x plus 3 by 2 log x square plus 7 plus c. Whenever we have function raised to the power n multiplied by first derivative, answer always be function to the power n plus 1 upon n plus 1 plus c. So in this kind of question, we always put fx equals to d or we can use this formula straight away. Example 1, 2x multiplied by x square plus 1 raised to the power 3. Now derivative of x square plus 1 is 2x. So put x square plus 1 equals to t and differentiate respect to x both sides will get 2x equals to dt by dx. So 2x dx equals to dt and when we replace in the quotient we will get integration of t cube dt and the answer is t to the power 4 upon 4 plus c. Replace t by x square plus 1 and the answer is x square plus 1 whole is power 4 divided by 4 plus c. Next example. e raised to the power x multiply by e raised to the power x whole power 3 by 2 integrate respect to x. Derivative of e to the power x plus 1 is e to the power x. So put e raised to the power x plus 1 equals to t. Differentiate respect to x both side. e raised to the power x equals to dt by dx. So e to the power x into dx equals to dt. Replace in the quotient and we will get t to the power 3 by 2 dt. And the answer is e to the power 5 by 2 upon 5 by 2 plus c. Replace t by e to the power x plus 1. So the answer is 
2 by 5 multiplied by e to the power x plus 1 whole to the power 5 by 2 plus c. Next example. Integrate 5 plus log x whole q divided by x. We can rewrite this question this way. Integration of 5 plus log x whole q multiplied by 1 by x respect to x. The derivative of function is 1 by x. So answer is 5 plus log x whole power n plus 1 upon n plus 1 is 4 by 4 plus c. Next example, 2x plus 1 multiplied by x square plus x dx, x square plus x in root. If we rewrite this question, we can say that x square plus x to the power 1 by 2 into 2x plus 1. Function derivative is present side by side. So we can say that answer is x square plus x to the power 3 by 2 upon 3 by 2 plus c. Next example x square multiplied by 4x cube plus 5 whole is power 7 by 2. Derivative of 4x cube plus 5 is 12x square. So divide by 12 and multiply by 12. And we get 1 by 12, 12x square, 4x cube plus 5 whole is power 7 by 2. If we rewrite this question, we say 1 by 12 into 4x cube plus 5 is power 7 by 2 into 12x square. Function to the power 7 by 2 and the derivative is present side by side. So we can straight away write answer 1 by 12 common. 4x cube plus 5 to the power 7 by 2 plus 1 is 9 by 2 divided by 9 by 2 and the answer is 1 upon 54 4x cube plus 5 whole is power 9 by 2 plus c.